anything, so I don't think I'm going to do any of those. We'll try triple again. Uh, I am PST. Spend my ballistas. Frost creep, I do like to get eventually. Yeah. The other thing you the, the other thing you can't get is ketchup chips, which is very disappointing. I do love me mana bolts, but I don't actually have. I'm just gonna get the mana bank and then whatever. I at least have a source of mana. Do enjoy me a longbow. Banditry all day. Oh yeah, I lived in... Uh... Well, I lived in SF for a while. I don't care for any of these that much. We'll take long bolts, but... Not super enthusiastic about that. I like getting one level in the long bolts, but more than that just feels a little bit a little bit much. Now that we have that I might as well fill those out. Right. I've never actually used the Tesla. I should maybe try it out. Um, yeah, it's, it's really nice. It's just like, yeah, I don't know. It's a weird place. Tesla coil. Do we try it? I do like, I, I always end up getting that crit, so I'm just going to get that for now. I don't have my, uh, uh, I have to change some of these around, to be honest. The targeting on these, I'm just overkilling stuff. The Shredder did quite well for us last time. I'm going to go, I'm going to go Shredder, Ballista, Poison Tower, and, and, uh, Mortar, I think. It's a lot of towers, but. Yeah, yeah, I enjoyed it. I, I, to be honest, I mostly moved for tax reasons, because it's like a lot of money, and eventually I'm just gonna move back to Canada. Two armor, fifty percent bleed, sure. Ooh, no banditry. You're like a house like this, I just like I don't I don't know. I don't want to spend the gold. I feel like it's just it's too far out. We were gonna put one here though. We were doing that, and then we're building a shredder. Ideally one that can hit multiple lanes. It is a little I would like to have it closer to the, the beginning of the lane, but that's fine. There's the mortar. I like to see that. I don't have gold. That is the shredder on it. I think I need to expand this lane. You are going to go ahead and go most armor. I 
think the range is too good of an upgrade to pass. Armor. Uh, no, I'm in Nevada. Vegas. I know a bunch of people who moved to Washington, though. I was kind of split between the two. I might, I might move. I've only been here for a little bit. Once summer comes, if it's, like, insanely hot and I hate it, I might just leave and go either to Washington. I might go up to Reno or something like that. I don't really care that much. Area of effect, I think, is another upgrade that's just, like, it's too good. We pass up. Spread these out. I think I'm going to still put... I'm going to put this guy on most health. I get some more shredders going, I think. area of effect all day I think I was close. Okay, I'm gonna have to push this lane out a bit. Okay, I do have mana banks already, so I'll go ahead and grab Frost. Or I'll start building up there eventually. I don't quite understand how these things work. Apparently it's like the snow particle or something like that. Yeah, the, the, getting the targeting right is a little bit hard on these. I'm kind of getting screwed by uh, a lack of a lack of targeting there. I'll go for a uh, most armor. Yeah, I was, uh, I got lucky that they closed down my office, because I was at a smaller office, and they ended up closing it down, so we got to go all remote. Uh, I think I need more mortars. Gonna go armor. Definitely gonna have problems with shields, I think. But uh, we'll figure that out once we get there. I feel like mortars are so strong, you can just build them and go attack shields. Uh, frost bolts every day. Yeah, I'm going to keep pushing these two out. Okay, uh, Ballista, let's go uh, most health. Health, and then we will do another stack of ballistas that I will sell. Health. Most health.
Yeah, I feel like companies are just like they like their offices. I would definitely have to go back to the office if I didn't like RNG into uh, being remote. I just got lucky they closed down my office. Don't actually. Have any poison? But I do want to get the poison towers. I'm gonna go. Is that shield? Oh, fuck. Upgraded the wrong one. And we're selling these. Uh, let's go ahead and go for another shredder here. Yeah, definitely having issues with shields. Oh, I always forget about these stress. Damage to shields, yes. Okay, I'm gonna need some mana banks now. Okay, we'll get the poison sprayer. I like this circling around. That's nice. This may be a little bit short. I'm just trying to drag these two out and then this lane can get killed by like all this stuff that can can this hit? Yeah, this can hit both lanes too. Yeah. Yeah, I kind of fucked myself with this positioning. Let's, uh, actually, I don't want to build a. Po I want to build a poison sprayer. I think way back here. Yeah. Poison sprayer way back here. Uh, upgrade shield damage. I gotta watch my mana. Actually, let me build a man one man bank before I screw myself. I guess a poison sprayer there. I might I'm gonna I think I'm gonna pop this out one more. Fifty percent poison damage, yeah we'll do that. Nice, okay that works for me. Poison sprayer here I guess. And shield damage. The the menu's kinda of funny in this game, how you like can zoom in and out. All right, I think I need to think about more frost creeps. Or uh, frost keeps, I should say. Yeah, we'll work on pushing our bleeds up. I'm gonna try and, I don't usually do that much with dots. I'm gonna try and use more dots like that this is getting a wrap around. Oh, nice. I was curious if that would be able to hit it.
I definitely need to get some source of burn soon. Do I have it on my... No, I don't have it on my mortars. I think that's the only place I can get it. I'm hoping that that shows up. Because there's a... I forget. I think it, it might not be till like level 30 plus where you get that... Uh, there's like a massive regen on, uh, on these armored guys. But if you have any source of burn, even like one burn on it, it reduces it to nothing. Uh, so we'll do that. Do a frost creep here. Yeah, we'll do one there. Yeah, that just doubled up. So this is going to be quite a lot. That's going to be a problem for me, I think, this lane. Um, let's just dump money into the shield here. I have a good amount of poison damage. I think I, I can start putting these shredders a little bit farther forward as well. I do have to really start looking out for the for the burn damage though. Most armor, I think we need a little bit more into that. And this one. Yeah, I don't know. Um, I honestly have no idea how haunted houses work. It's like, does it give you increased bounty? I've, I've only, I think I've only gotten them once. I honestly have no idea how they work. I gotta watch my mana. Get another. Yeah, if I don't get burned soonish, I'm gonna be fucked. Maybe. I don't know, actually. I don't know what level it... Uh, you know what? I don't think it's till 30+. plus. Maybe I'm being a bit dramatic. Um, oh, if you kill them near a tombstone? Yeah, a lot of stuff has to be at the exact same level. The mana, the mana crystals are like that too, I think. Um, are houses like that? Houses might be like that too. I don't know. Where's a house that has two levels near it? Uh, I don't actually have one. I wish the, the other the other thing that I wish the game had was like a 2x speed up because like once these lanes get this fucking long, it takes a little while. Slows them by five percent of the poison gained. That seems good. Um, I love to take banditry, but I want to try this out. I've never tried creeping cough. Um, I'm gonna give you a little bit more chill damage. Yeah, I'm just going to keep running this out, I think.
I really like uh, I like how the uh, the saw blades deal with these guys because they can be annoying. The really fast ones. I'm liking the saw blades for that actually. Work. Yeah, we're kind of flirting with low mana. We're just gonna do it. I think I'm gonna push this out a little bit now. Am I? No, nah, I'm not going to actually. But I might invest a little bit more. I think I'm going to drop a frost creep keep here. Yeah, I played uh I did play loop hero but not that much of it. Um Go for crit. Ah, poisoned extra one shield damage from all attacks. I don't know that shields are really a problem for me, but that does seem pretty good because I am poisoning everything pretty quickly. I'm just going to pick up an extra mortar here on armor. How's this lane doing? This lane? Yeah, this lane could use a little bit of help. Oh, I didn't realize Loop Hero had that many people working on it. Yeah, I don't know what I want to do in this top lane. I do feel like that needs something a little bit extra. I could stick a slow in here as well, I guess. Throw down a mana bank. Again, I don't know how good this... Does it do it instantly? Crits deal 10% of the current poison damage is extra poison damage, or does it just add that poison damage? Because I feel like I'm, I just have a shit ton of poison stacked on people, and stacking more on doesn't really do anything to me. Do anything for me. Um, well, whatever, we'll just take it. I don't know that I'll actually be able to figure that out one way or the other, but... I think another little bit of... Ooh, zombie Ogi. I didn't even realize. I wish there was a bit of a sound that was like, hey, it's a boss level. Uh, and let's go ahead and we'll slow him down over here. Most shields. Most shields. Or most shields. Yeah. There's a reasonable amount of stuff in this game that I'm like a little bit unsure about. Like the, I have one poison tower and like maybe he would run out of that poison by the end. Uh, you know what? He's he's running out of it. Maybe I'm being unfair. Yeah, he's slowly running out of poison there, but he is like, 
Ooh, more crit? Is that what we're going for? Yeah, I think so. Let's demolish. I guess, sure. A lot of chess. Ooh, we are into the point in the game where I can start getting universities. I'm going to have to think about that, but I'm going to get stuff that actually helps me for now. So I have to... I have to kill stuff within range of this or something. I'm just going to pick it up. Um, do I have any doubles? Like, I have no idea. Like, tech, death tax do. No idea how that works. Um... But whatever. Ooh, we have a reasonably large amount of gold. Let's get um, this armor thing upgraded. Armor is definitely a problem, I think, for me. How's this doing up here? Yeah, definitely having armor problems. I think we'll go for a mortar armor. Get another shredder, I think. I almost feel like, yeah, I don't understand quite how the blades work. Sometimes it feels like it's just, there's a distance thing. It also feels like maybe it's like number of enemies or something. It has to be near a tombstone. Yeah, like, like, I don't know. Oh, like I have to put a building near the tombstone or something? Increase maximum bleed. 30 to 80. I think I just need more bleed. I don't know that I'm actually running out. Yeah, I, I like... Yeah, it's collected 10, uh, so that seems not worth, but who knows. Kind of want to get more poison sprayers. Yeah, I definitely have a, a lot of gold. I think I'm going to get a health poison sprayer here. Grab another mana bank. Yeah, I have I have this one here by this tombstone. And it like I guess I've gotten ten gold out of it. I don't understand yeah, yeah, that's like where I'm at. I don't understand the tax efficiency or the death tax do thing. So Sure. Work on my shield damage. Okay. Uh, remind me to take university if I see it. I think I need to get a bit more armor. I think I need to get another armor. 
mortar up there. How's this doing? This is doing pretty well. Not great, though. Same with this lane. It's like, at some point, that's going to start falling off. Right, let's see how much bleed I have on these guys. Okay, I can get, I can start to get more bleed tick, I think. Shit, I still need to get burn, though. That's actually the most important thing, is that I get burn. Yeah. The uni scale is super strong with like these poison. Anything that has a fi really high uh, ri fire rate. I assume the fire tower as well. Uh, we will take university. It also unlocks some decent upgrades too. I feel like the crit is decent. Um, university, 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 and then we will go health. Uh, ooh, I don't have actually that much money on me. Band. It is it is kind of RNG though. I kind of wish maybe like you got like the the universities produce like research points and then you could uh, place them. Yeah, the crit is super good, totally. Because like the way I don't. Yeah, eventually you get to like times three crit and stuff. Shit. Okay, I'm having issues down here. It looks like mostly health issues. Let's get a. Uh oh. Okay, I don't know why all of a sudden I started doing so poorly down this lane. Um. How's this one doing? This one seems to do did fine. I don't know why this one doesn't have a split in it. Um, maybe we'll just go for a health damage mortar. Oh, I should be upgrading my universities though. Before the turn rolls over. Yeah, it does have pretty little damage. This lane doesn't have very much damage either. I think, I feel like there's, you know, I guess this one has the, yeah, this guy can fire into that lane as well. Bleeding enemies take plus one. I think I'm going to go with that. Um, that seems reasonably strong. And I, I just, I'm going to leave those lanes. It means I want to get my bleed going earlier in all my lanes, though. So I think I'm going to build a shredder up farther up here, just so I can get that bleed stacking. I do kind of want to, uh, yeah, I might actually expand this lane. I want to, I like how this one wraps around, and I want to do that with this lane, too. I'm just worried about it splitting, because I really don't want to have it split. Uh, yeah. Is that... Oh, sucks. Um, demolish. Oh, actually, I don't really want that. The brown square towers, like uh, how you can put you can put stuff on here for like plus six and stuff. I might, I, I just like, there's not enough lane, there's only two lane openings in range. Um, how's stuff doing over here? Stuff's fine. So I want to get a shredder. I'm really tempted to bring this lane down. 
but I'll be pissed if it splits. And I, yeah, I think I'm getting to the point where I actually really need to get that burn because I'm going to run into the, the super regen armor guys. We'll see. There's, they start showing up somewhere around now. Yeah, I, I don't care. You can say whatever. Um, crit. Yeah, if this splits... Okay, it didn't split. Oh, okay, that's Pog. Shredder. Get that bleed going. I'm just really, I'm just like really wary of either of these two lanes um, splitting. Because they're just much, it's much easier to deal with if I have just like kind of these weak lanes over here. And then I have all the, like the bulk of stuff is coming through, through these, this one lane here. And I can kind of focus on that. And my like, all my like late game single target stuff that I'm building for this lane ends up like hitting these lanes as well. A tower on the S lane. Oh yeah, yeah. I put I stuck this here because I want the the bleeding to give an extra the extra damage from bleed. I might actually, yeah, I might give this a little bit actually gold. I have a lot of gold. Yeah, my main concern is getting a source of burn for the for the armor regen. Gonna give this a little bit of extra gold too. Shield damage. Yep. Oh, in the south lane. Oh, I think that's just the mortar. Oh, in the next segment. Yeah, I I like how much this one wraps around. To be honest, already, I'm not I'm not willing to risk it for this one to. To the, on the chance oh there we go okay i'm actually going to pick up some extra mortars just because of that so that's already on most health i'm going to go most armor on this i definitely need to make sure burns are consistently applied armor um, and we're just dragging this lane out. Ooh, shit. I should have invested more in my, uh, my university. We do, we got one health damage. That's not bad. The south, like this... This is then the south lane? Uh, okay, I gotta watch out here. I think this is actually the exact round where the, yeah, these are the, uh, those are the guys that regen super fast. That's funny that I got, I got that burn on the exact, like, moment I needed it. And yet we're still kind of getting fucked up a little bit. My mana is definitely flirting with running out. What level is this? Believe that. This lane? Top, southwest. Oh, like up in here? I'm going to invest a little bit more in this. I kind of feel like my run is like RNG based on how much my university pays out. Three percent bonus for all research. Yeah, I'll take that. Well, I feel like Southwest is like here, is Southwest, or here. I do have this tower. I have the, 
um, shredder on it. Yeah, that's southeast. This is, I would say this is southwest here, right? But I don't think that there's like a... Oh, spot for another uni. Oh shit, sorry. I thought you were talking about um I thought you were talking about this thing. Yeah, yeah. Good call. Okay, I'm a bit retarded. Don't mind me. Um once we get the gold I'll Oh nice, I actually got another spot too. No, no problem. I I thought you were talking about this uh tower thing and not the university. We'll pop these down because I get a free three percent. Nah, no problem. I, I like, yeah, I don't know. I didn't realize you were talking about the university. I should, I should have noticed that too. Ah, uh, goddamn, we're getting close. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay, what do I want to do here? I just kind of want to invest in my universities a little bit. Um, let's go health. I think like health and armor are my problem. How much gold do I have? A thousand. And then I'm going to get, I think actually at this point, I think I'm going to get some poison sprayers that are health focused here. Progress. Uh, is there a better spot for that? Where can, yeah, if I bought down, it would be potentially a better spot. But yeah, let's go health damage. 2% bonus all research. Yeah, we're going to take that. Yeah, I feel like I'm in. The, I'm at the point of the game where, like, if I, my research can get going, and I can get some lucky research, then I'm good. But I could also just lose, like, right now. Hmm. This guy's gonna go in on health. Because as soon as like I get enough research, the poison sprayers just go out of control, and I need mana. Mana bank, mana bank. All right, what are the levels like? Let's put a little bit more gold in here. Get a bit of armor. Hundred, two eighty, okay. Ooh, okay, I've not invested in these at all. Whoops. Well, that was a misallocation of funds. But let's go in a little bit before the level rolls over. Okay, we'll see, we'll see what we get. I think it I think it rolls over on the level. I do have a good number, and I have uh, a, re a reasonable amount of upgrades for them, too. Uh, all towers gain 5% crits. I do like that. Or maybe it's when I hit expand. I hope it is, because I didn't get anything there. I have enough that, like, I feel like I should get some. Expand? Oh, yeah, it is. So it's on expand. Uh, so there is Oogie as well. Let's uh, let's slow him over here. Yeah, I'm going to slow him on this area. Most health. No 
most health, health, health. Okay, how are my other lanes doing? Okay, that looks fine. This I'm gonna throw in a little bit of upgrades to. Yeah, nice. I'm getting into the times three crit stuff, which is nice. I kind of want to try um, to see if I can build beat the single lane with only ballistas. I think probably not. I don't think... Okay, I gotta watch this. Uh, yeah, we're gonna sell you. Let's get another slow stack going up this way, I guess. Health. Health. Most health. Demolish, demolish, demolish. It's nice that the universities are when you expand, so I don't have to actually worry about it until... Uh... Yeah, my uh, when, my first run where I beat um, the... The sort of, uh, whatever you might call it, the main kind of game, the first level, I had like, uh, like 4x crit times 30 on my... Okay, demolish. I want him to be max slowed going through this. Most health, uh, demolish, demolish. Okay, he's the only one left, so I can just stop targeting, which is nice now. Oh, that's a shit ton of armor, though. I don't love that. Um, most armor. Let's go invest some in armor damage. Okay, we got a good amount of burn on. Okay, that poison actually comes off pretty quick. I'm surprised. Uh, now my next... Oop, I'm actually low on gold. Yeah, I feel like I, I take the bosses a little bit too seriously. All towers gain a 5% a crit. I like that. See what we get from the treasure chests. Um, yeah, these are all just kind of whatever. I wouldn't mind getting HE filled out. 1% bonus to all research. Is that worth it? Yeah, I mean, I don't like the other ones, so it is. Magnetic blades. That lets me get crit. Next one. Um, oh, haunted houses. Okay, great. Twice as efficiently. Um, sure. All towers gain a 5% crit. Thank you. 25% bleed on mortars. I think that's just the best that I have. I'm actually tempted to go... No, I just... I would like to get this if I didn't unlock the research. You know, and I just put these like near my tower just as like a little bit of a safety thing. But I don't want to unlock the research is like the issue. Uh, okay, I got 3k. Let me look at these. I think I can invest a little bit in here. Yeah. So I think health. Um, maybe a bit of armor. How's this guy doing? Okay, I'm going to invest a little bit in this. I'm a little bit worried about my side lanes. I'm pretty confident with this, this lane now, but maybe not. No research. We did get, we did get a bunch of research, but no uh, research area. Yeah, I like to get, I like to get everything on the, the mortars, like just like every single status effect. 
Yeah, I think the mortars in general are kind of a little like... The poison towers get nutty, though. Um, because they attack so fast, and once like once we start getting that stack damage... Like, I'm going to invest... If I can, I'm going to invest research into poison towers at this point in time. I might put down a frost keep here. Uh, fastest is this way. I'm going to distribute some ballistas, I think, on fastest. To help clump stuff up. Yeah, okay, that's, I'm feeling pretty good, because I feel like right after the boss, there's a bit of a power spike. Yeah, I want to get I want to get some of the I don't have that much in the way of burn and bleed unlocked yet. <laughs> I'm just I'm worried about these two the side lanes a little bit. Uh, decay a progress tree perk. Uh, I'm not sure what you mean, like, by decay. Like, the, the upgrades to the, uh, to the burn and bleed and stuff. Maximum burn, we'll probably get that. Because I think I'm stacking up enough. But the thing is, it's like I feel like I just like 25% bleed is uh, isn't really that useful. I do like the plus one EMP, but we'll do that. Um, I'm kind of conflicted between investing in my. Uh, universities and investing in my poison sprayers i think i'm going to run them up to like 300 oh uh i'm not sure to be honest i don't know all right we'll call that good for those universities I'll keep dragging this lane out. Yeah, I think a lot of there's a lot of RNG on getting these shrines. Like this just gives me so much. The seven health damage just gives me so much extra damage on these. Because of the like the way it multiplies, like kind of the quadratic sort of thing. Um Okay, that lane seems fine. I actually, I'm going to invest a little bit in shield there. Probably don't need to. I think I'm going to drop a mortar. I, I'm going to try and get some burns applied with my mortar a little bit earlier on. I'm seeing like a lot of armor come through and I feel pretty confident with uh, shields and health with my poison sprayers, but armor is I think my weak spot right now. We can just get those burns going and also get, yeah, these guys are nutty. If you don't have burn, like I actually don't want to level up my burn per second, I don't think, because it's like I'm worried about it coming off. See how much they regen? Okay, well, it's hard to see. Okay, there. You can see that one regening a lot, right? So I'm actually like, yeah, I'm actually kind of worried about that. Yeah, yeah, totally. 
Yeah, the, the yeah, and the plus damage, the way it works with like fast attacking towers is just absurd. Like I guess the I haven't actually tried it with the obelisk, but I guess the obelisk is insane because it's 360, whereas these are I mean these themselves are insane, but uh, these are like um what are they 90 yeah so the obelisk is like even more burning enemies burn faster i don't actually want them to burn faster because i don't want the burn to disappear i guess i'm gonna go with this this eventually lets me get into the crit upgrade which is really nice yeah, I guess armor is my problem, so why not just invest a little bit in armor? I'll keep dragging these out. No more research pads, but that's like I'm I'm fine with the amount of research that we've got even there. I guess eventually, I guess I'm going to start seeing some enemies that have, uh, okay, I got to pay attention to these lanes too. Shit, okay. That's actually, I think, where the obelisk would be really good, or in these side lanes. Shit, okay, this is actually a bit of a problem. Uh, do I go ballistas? How's this? This lane's, I think, a lot better than my other lane, so I'm going to invest in... Uh, I think health damage on this guy. That's going to help a lot, this lane. Got shield damage. I don't, yeah, I really don't love how this lane doesn't have a twist in it. You know? Very, like, this very straight long lane. And also this mana thing fucks my positioning for my poison. Yeah, mortars are, are pretty OP. That's like I beat the the one lane I think I beat using a very similar build to this actually, but like my mortars like completely carried the entire game. I kind of think that I'm I'm, I'm okay here. And I want to a little shore up my final defense a little bit. Um, oh, you know what? I don't have frost. That's a bit of a mistake to not have the frost there. And I feel like actually the plus three isn't even good because it spreads out more. Like, I feel like the number of snowflakes is fixed. Let me slap down a mana bank just as a hedge. So it's like, I mean, I'm just going to add another and I hope that improves the slow, but who knows? And I think I'm going to drop in another Shredder as well. Just to get that bleed going. 10% uh, of the current bleed is extra bleed. That sounds pretty good. I do want to get my Poison Sprayers, though. Like, I just feel like I might as well just go focus on Poison Sprayers now that I have this much flat damage coming in. As extra bleed damage. We do have a reasonable amount of bleed coming out from the shredder. Nah, I'm just I'm going in on the poison. Uh, we got a portal there, which is fine. These ones, I, I kind of want to expand them, but my, my fear is that I get a split. That's like what I'm afraid of is that they split. Otherwise, like, I, yeah, I totally would expand them. I think they're actually a lot safer. The fact that I didn't have the frost the frost things here is, is like, a, that was a big over, that was a big mistake on my part, um, not having those. And I'm actually going to get another one. I just want more slow in this area and this area. Mana bank.
I think I'm going to get more armor mortars here as well. I think that that's my other weak spot on these. Um, I'm tempted to actually put that on progress because it's not necessarily the most armor. I just care about having burn up on the uh, on the ones that uh, that regen armor. Maybe I, to be honest, I die I died to the to the things that that regen armor. So I probably like over. I'm overly afraid of them. I got, yeah, I had a run where I like made it super far and I think I actually would have won on my, on doing my one lane. And then I, uh, I just died to, uh, all towers get 5% crit. You just can't argue with that. Yeah, well, that's just too good. Um, sure. We'll expand this out. I'm just going to go most armor. I think that's probably a waste, actually. I don't know why I did that. I think for the cost, I think the frost creeps are pretty good here. Yeah, this does. This is like it's so much easier now that the frost creeps are there. Um, Ooh, that's not nice looking. Okay, how's stuff doing there? Okay, we're actually in a bit of a bad spot right now. That was super close. Uh, these are super close too. I think health damage on this, I need a bit of. How's this lane? I feel like this lane's doing fine. Uh, so every every single opening spawns um, enemies. The portal is just means I can't expand that lane. All right, I think uh, I kind of need like some last line defense. The way like the damage works being quadratic, I just feel like I have to, at this point with these upgrades, I have to just invest in uh, single towers. I honestly, I um, I watched some other people play this before I bought it and I saw the Tesla tower seem super weak, so I've never actually used it. So I can't say for sure that it sucks, but it seems like it sucks. There's some chance that maybe just like it has to get upgraded and stuff. Like these poison ones are, not great early on but now like i have a bunch of these things that add flat damage and so the way the damage works in this game is you have base damage and then it gets multiplied by these multipliers so if you add like flat damage to something that has a very fast fire rate and aoe then like it scales super hard so this is like a scaling tower that does really well um later on but starts out kind of weak it's in the, in the beginning, it's a really good way to deal with shields, but later on, late game, it's a really good way to deal with everything. I'm tempted to get obelisks as my um, kind of last line of defense. Yeah, all right, we'll do that. Um... And now I need, I need, I think, what is it? Three mana banks per obelisk or something like that. Something ridiculous. Yeah. Okay. I don't know if that, I need to level them up. That's for sure. So what stuff comes through with health, right? Is like the main, the main damage type that makes it through my other stuff.
Yeah, I, I, I'll try Tesla's out at some point. I'm trying to beat the, uh, the three lane. Ooh, no research. That sucks. I don't know that I need an obelisk in this lane. I should probably just hold a certain amount of gold so I can just slap an extra obelisk down. I'm slightly worried that I actually need more mana. How much did these give again? Um, mana bank gives me... Yeah, I think it's three per obelisk, but I could be wrong. It's possible to not expand. I'm not sure. I've never run into that. I think the game... I think it would break the game because you need to expand. When you expand, it starts the next wave. So I assume, unless the game is bugged, that uh, you can always expand. Okay. What do we got coming through? Mostly it looks like health. And health is just going to get pogged down by this guy. Okay, and here, yeah. Okay. I'm gonna put a couple more upgrades into health on this. On the tower near the portal. Oh, um, oh there yeah i think i think that like uh i think they're good as like a final defense for aoe but i don't know that it would be i don't know if, i don't want to like burn that much mana i think having them after my aoe makes sense how much is it is it a plus like oh it's plus five i might actually i'm probably actually that's you know what that's a good point i'm gonna slap a mortar on there i think uh, and go on to armor. Yeah, that's nice. I like that. Thanks for pointing that one out. And then I think... What are you at? You're at a thousand health damage. You're at... You're at a thousand shield. You actually could be, honestly, I kind of want to just pump you a little bit more. And we'll pump this guy a little bit. I think at this point I'm kind of going to switch between just upgrading all my different uh, poison sprayers. Uh, I love a 10% crit chance, but I don't know that my shredders are doing that much at this point. They're kind of slow attacking. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to invest in my shredders. Yeah, I want to. I'm gonna get this on. The, you know what? I'm pretty close to the five. I was gonna say I, I want to get towards the crit. Um, I really hope that I'm not forced to expand here. Those ones, shit, I might end up being. As long as they don't split, it's fine. Yeah. And I, it, there's a lot of armor in the game. Like, there's a lot of armor coming out. It's nice to clear that out before it gets into this, because like this area doesn't have great anti-armor damage. Oh, we've got another one doing that up here too. Okay, I gotta watch these other lanes, because they could all of a sudden just like start scaling. But yeah, I think mostly I'm just gonna add a little bit of health to these. I'm going to try and hold, I think, about like 5,000 gold. Four thousand gold. So I can try to react to a lane getting pushed. I really wish I... I mean, I got... To be honest, I got pretty lucky with my early universities, but I feel like it would be somewhat nice if we got a... Uh, a little bit of a more universities later on. Thirteen eight five, I think, is still pretty good.
Um, if I get forced to, I will. But I'm, I'm gonna keep going. I'm, I'm gonna keep going top. The risk that these split, I think, is just like that's something that can actually just break my game. I'm kind of holding money. Yeah. Like, if, if this ends up becoming a portal, I'm going to start holding money as I expand so I can invest in whatever lane if it splits. One, two, three. Like, it would be a huge increase in the number of monsters to come out, If especially if I got a three split. I'd have to... It would be like... Yeah, it would be difficult to manage. Uh, all mortars gain bleed. I think I'm already essentially going to be bleed capped. I'm tempted to get the encampment and spam those near my main tower, but I don't think I will. I think we'll go HE shells, because that, uh, that gets me towards the crit, but I think the game ends at 45, so it's not really particularly likely that I'm going to actually get to that. What are my... How much damage did these do? I'm tempted to actually get mana bolts. Base damage 12 plus 3. Because it the mult it multiplies with this, right? Um I would have to invest a little bit more in mana banks, but I think that that is actually my best chance of actually winning. And I'm I'm actually gonna spam some more ballistas just for and put them on fastest. Uh, I'm going to take some of these and put them on fastest. After 40, it caps on lanes. That maybe makes sense, because there's like, uh, I've only ever gotten um, portals here. That would definitely help. Okay. Yeah, so I'm going to invest in these a little bit more. I kind of want to hold gold, but not too much. Yeah, these poison towers just start pogging. I think I should get one shredder up here just to like get the uh, the bleed going. Uh, you know what? I actually have bleed on my eh, whatever. I'll leave it. I do have bleed on my um, other guy. One thing is, yeah, is these shield armor guys are kind of a bit of a problem for me, where they go shield armor then health. To be fair, I feel like this this tower is just I'm just gonna go in a bit of armor on it. Cause I think um, I get through the poison pretty quickly. Like the poison gets through the shield super quickly. Spores. Um, I don't know that that helps me that much. I think I have, like, I don't think, 
I think I'm cap. Uh, I wish I could see. I should have paid more attention, but I think I cap out on poison damage at this point. But I'm not really super fussed about shields. I think I get through shields pretty well. Um, I could put. I could go with another poison sprayer and go. A shield focused one here on progress and that lets me just get their shields down a little bit earlier okay, I don't want to spend too much more all right uh, what one of these lanes do I want to wrap let's do this one okay yeah I think maybe you're right about the whole uh... tempting to build a poison sprayer there to have sick range I could shoot down that whole line would it yeah, it would. Um, okay, then I guess, yeah, 45 is the last round. Okay, I think, I think I'm guaranteed that Oogie doesn't spawn in either of those two lanes, but I'm not positive. Um, we'll, we'll cross our fingers. Yeah, that, uh, that university plus the, the sprayers is so good. Yeah, this is the first time I've, uh, this, well, this is the farthest I've got in the, um, the three lanes so far. The one lane, I think, is very RNG based on, like, how soon you get your splits. If you get a really, really long section of super straight area, the, the one lane can be pretty, pretty easy. But if you get, like, a lot of splits early, the one lane can be, like, almost as hard as the three lane. It does get slow. That is like one thing. I did I do wish there was like a 2x speed or whatever. In some in some ways that's because I dragged these lanes out super far. So I would have like one main lane with a lot of portals and then just two like kind of side lanes. Maximum burn. Obelisks. I don't think any of these are particularly that useful to me. Um Maximum burn to 30 to 80. I actually don't want to up my burn at all on the off chance I lose it on the, the super regen guys. Sharpen blades. Um, I guess HE shells is probably the most useful. And now, okay, so where's Oogie spawning? Uh, is 45? I thought 45 was the last one. Oh, okay, there he is. Let's go ahead and go... Most health. Most health. Slow that guy down. Most health. Uh, and I just want to look at my other lanes to make sure they're not getting fucked. They look okay-ish. Yeah, I think they're fine. Okay. All right. We can go back to uh, dealing with this guy. And we'll get him slowed up again more over here. And we'll just keep him slowed. I think we will get a little bit more upgrade shield damage. Then I think here I'm going to get an obelisk as well. Or let's get ballistas for the slow. 
Definitely want to make sure he's max slowed in this area. Now I'm going to hold the obelisks until later. I don't think that I'm actually going to need it. I don't think I'm going to have a problem killing this guy, but... Um, if I do have issues, I guess theoretically I can sell out. I'm not going to. I feel like that's cheap. As I could just sell all this shit. I guess I don't I don't actually get that much money because I don't get the upgrade. Yeah, okay. So that's not worth it. Um, a ballista. But I do want to make sure that all this stuff is dead before he gets through, which it looks like it is. Demolish, demolish, demolish. All right. Beautiful. So it's basically equal health, life, mana type thing. Get you going on upping your shield damage a little bit. Yeah. I wish I, I should have got mortar range, I think. I guess these stack up the burn, which is fine. Which eventually will tick down his armor. I'm some I'm slightly worried about his armor, that if I don't get through his armor by this point, like this is mostly health damage. So I'm somewhat tempted to uh Okay, yeah, oh I want ballistas here. Oh, I should also have a frost. I want to make sure he's max slow coming through here. And max slow coming through here as well. I don't think I'm going to have a problem, but better safe than sorry. Then I'll put an obelisk here. I'm just going to replace that. And I'll upgrade this obelisk um, if we need to, based on whatever he has left. But in all honesty, I mean, look, he's already we're already through his shield, right? Now we've got the armor. The armor is a little bit tough, that's for sure. But yeah, OK, no, we're obviously going to win. <clears throat> I guess the little guys he spawns are potentially dangerous, but uh, if we're, we're down to health now, he's dead. This guy will just chew through that in like a second. All right. Okay. That was pretty good. Damn, Shredder. Okay, I underestimate the Shredder, man. It, to be fair, it's actually, it's like I didn't invest very much gold in them. So that like doesn't pump, pump up the cost. I don't know, maybe I do underestimate them. All right, good game. 